Hello guys, this is the Axon Files, and today I will be teaching you to program your TI-83 or 84 calculator to have a cross product of two vectors. So let's see how it actually works now. So let's go to program. I called it Crow Pro. So Crow Pro. So the format is basically a vector in parentheses. Like, so there's I, J, and K as like the X, Y, and Z axes axes and a b c are the coefficients of the first vector and d e and f are the coefficients of the second vector so if you don't have a z axis in your vector just put a, a zero as your variable c and f okay so let's get started so let's first try to find the uh, product of vector three negative one five and then the second vector is 6, 2, negative 9. So what it will return us is the coefficients of the, the final vector, which is negative 1, 57, and 12, which we can double check. Okay, and also, you can also look at down at the key press history if you want to follow along better. So let's go to program now and make it. Let's go to program, new. So let's call this cross product cross cross pro okay so cross pro now let's enter so first we need to display what the format is so let's go to control i o so c three for display so in quotes display display the the space format oh my bad Format, the format is, so then you do alpha in parentheses, a comma b comma c, uh, close parentheses and end quotes. For now, then let's go to the next line and let's put display again so that these will be on two different lines. Um, so three for display, display, then in quotations, then alpha again, C. So no, it's D, it's, hold up, it's times D comma E comma F. Okay, so let's close brackets and close quotes. Okay, so now basically we just prompt for all these variables. So let's go to i slash show prompt. So prompt a comma b all the way to f comma c comma d comma e comma f. So then let's enter. Now comes like the more difficult part. So this is just a, like a confusing part. So this is what we have to do now. So we go to alpha f, f, f b minus c, c e, and we can store that as we can store that as I. So then let's go to the next line. So let's go now F A minus D D minus D C. So we can store that as J. So now let's go to the next line. So now we go to E A minus D B. We can store that as K. So now let's go to the last line and now we can just basically display an i slash show display 
display let's display that hmm. so the coefficients of I comma J comma K R so R then colon and quote oh, my bad alpha oh no yeah so you go to plus so we'll just end quotes here end quotes here so then you do comma I comma negative J comma K and we are done so now let's quit this program and so now let's go to program again let's uh, execute this cross product we just made so let's go to enter so now let's do the cross product 2 1 5 negative 3 2 9 and we get our answer as negative 1 negative 33 and 7 which can be represented in a vector form as negative i minus 33j plus 7k and we can double check this with google and it is correct so thank you for watching this axon files video if you enjoyed this video you might also enjoy the distance and midpoint formula and also our pythagorean theorem program on a ti-84 calculator well this has been the axon files and we'll see you next time